Welcome to PC Mac. Today we are going to make our Raspberry Pi 3 Model B Plus as a Wi Fi hotspot with the help of Tide Pi. So let's do it. First of all, we are going to open the wireless network watcher to check the IP address of our Raspberry Pi. And the IP address is right here, 73. Let's go and close it. And open SSH, OT, 192.168.1.73. Okay, let's log in with the root. And the password. So we are right here. Let's type write by software. It will open the same window through which we can go ahead and install. We need to navigate to software optimized. Click here and then move down. We need to select Wi Fi hotspot by pressing the space bar and then press OK. It will check the compatibility with the Wi Fi and the Ethernet cable. It will pop up the window in a moment. As you can see, the following criteria must be met and it's passed ethernet is passed and wi-fi adapter is detected because the model 3b plus have an inbuilt wi-fi adapter so we just need to click ok and then we need to navigate to install and once we go to ok and press enter it will start installing the wi-fi hotspot it might take two to five minutes to install this package we need to press OK and then the installation will be begin. I'll be back. Now, as you can see, the installation is complete. The system will now reboot and we got this error message. Press OK. This completes the Dite by software installation. So we will be able to see the Wi-Fi network in a moment right here. Right now I'm connected to my network, HK network and we will see the other network in a moment let's go ahead and try to connect restart the session and log in with the root and the password it's logged in let's go to the wi-fi again and check as you can see died by hotspot and the default password is died by hotspot all small d i e t p i hotspot next and then let's no and we are connected let's try to visit a website to check whether everything is working fine or not so we are successfully connected to our diet pie network it's right here let me just go ahead and close it and now I'll show you how you can change the settings of your hotspot. Let's again connect to HK network. I'm connected to my original network. Now I can go ahead and use this. We need to reconnect to the putty by starting the session. Boot. So we need to go into diet by config now we need to navigate to network options adapters and from here we can change the wireless network settings let's go and open it and as you can see on the top right here the died by hotspot that is the SSID and the key is died by hotspot and it's right now online we need to change the SSID let's go ahead and change it to PC Mac press OK and then leave the channel as it is then go to the key and type a key of your choice let's type password press OK now we need to go down and select apply save all changes and restart networking then press OK it will be done in a moment now we need to just go back as you can see the SSID is right here and the password as well and the channel is 3 
so let's just go back back exit then okay now we need to reboot our raspberry pi let's just do it so it's rebooting it will reboot in a moment we'll wait let's try to restart the session now so we are logged in let's check for the new network now and it's right here pc max secured let's try to connect to this network no and we are connected to our new network connected secured and it's working fine let's just try to go ahead and open google so everything is working from this network so let me just try to close it okay so guys you can also use tide pi and make your raspberry pi as a hotspot while using the other softwares as well because as you know tide pi has lots of software so you can install them as well and you can make your raspberry pi as your hotspot and use it as a hotspot while using the other softwares as well so guys if you like this video please hit the like button and subscribe to my channel if you have any questions you can write them in the comment section i'll try to answer them and thank you for watching bye bye take care have a nice day